Founded in 1184 as the Hospital of St Mary on the marsh belonging to Leicestershire Abbey, the ruins show that once it contained a hospital located on the marshland, which was later drained, becoming known as St Mary's of the Marsh. Look at that over there. We're out over there. It's not my storm chasing video this time, is it? It's so, it was sunny before and it's gone so dark and grim since we've come here. But I managed to get some general video shots, some GVs. Managed to get the drone up as well because the wind was picking up. But there's the chapel. A chapel that was established in 1180. 1180. This thing is like a thousand years old. The rich history that is involved here is a and everything else is saturated with ghost stories especially because there's been a burial ground not far from here I've seen online that there is some paranormal activity now this is our plan B because the original plan was to go to a mill in Chorley I'm not going to mention its name <laughs> but it's gone, they've pulled it down it's been kiboshed so let's crack on of this Kokistan's Abbey I can't talk, my mouth is freezing up <laughs> We're here at, what's the place called? Kokistan's Abbey. Kokistan's Abbey. I've already said that wrong. We were going to go to a mill, but uh, he said it was up this, this June. But he said it was up this, this June or January. Turns out they took it down, so now we're here. I'm very sad. I really want to go to the mill. Oh. A test. There's a ghost here. Copy me. Yeah, nothing. So, while Oliver's gone off to do some uh, B-roll footage, I thought I'd just give the ghost tube ago, which you did in the previous video. Hope you enjoyed that, by the way. Um, and we'll start off with that uses a data bank of words. Uh, there's 850 words on here. So the object of the game is, you'll have to excuse if there's a bit of a breeze, is I call out to any potential spirits and they can use the words inside this app, which I'll put the link in the description area down below. Murdered? Okay. Now because this was plan B, I wasn't intending to come here, uh, I've left my script, uh, script at home. So I'm going to have to voice over some of the ghost stories. But there is some online I've picked up on, I've had to do some digging, of strange sounds and noises. And of course, when King Henry VIII was kicking off about the, about the, uh, the, the, the faith, um, obviously he murdered priests and monks. They all, that's what priest souls are, hiding and stuff like that. Should we crack on? With respect, come here to communicate with you. Anyone who's part of this area, you come from this lands, the monks, the priests, the people, the farmers, anyone. If you've got any words that you want to put through this device in my hand, please do so and communicate with me. Go back, see if anything's happened. Probably not. Oh it came up as murdered. No shot. Seriously? I, I was just thinking, I just came to ask you for how'd you take photos? I'm just going to take a picture. Start again. I'm going to try and take a picture. Right. Just a record, that has never happened. What? Yeah, that has never happened. That camera's pretty faithful. Right, okay, so let's assume. Right, try again, brand new battery. We well, just started using that. I've put a light on as well. That's looking grim over there, look at the rain there. Holy moly crackers. Right, so using this device in my hand again, hopefully the camera's still running for the second time now. Would you like to bring a a word or two through here? 
Did you hear a thud? Yeah, did you not hear it? Is that what you were just saying then? Yeah, I heard a thud like... It, came, it sounded like it came from behind. Yeah, yeah, behind. I was just getting shot in the room when you were talking. I thought it was... That's bizarre. There's some rain coming, we're going to have to hide. I'm going to keep this running because that was definitely a thud noise then. Right, we need to get as much of this footage. Back on. That's weird. Did that film? Yeah, the batch is fine. Did that film any of that? Didn't know. Uh, I need to see now. So, I was just going to take a picture, but it turns out. Hang on. Someone turned my camera off. Someone turned his camera off? Yeah, they've got it. Oh. I've, done, I've got what I did, but it's gone off. Is it turned off again? Turned it off again. Try a new battery. I've got to try the watch while I'm watching. Spin round. Oh. This is now dying. Yet when you turn it on, it flashes. I've got to use the pod. This is dying. Right, yeah. Works. So I'm using the ghost shoe. This has got, um, rather than words, it's got sounds. Again, we've used this in the, in the locations, and then the voices are, di are different. Difficult to talk. Difficult to talk. Already. We've got some uh, plausible if there is responses. Anyone well. that wants to talk to us or communicate, there is a, a, a block device with an aerial or metal rod sticking out of it. And if you go near that, that will alert us that you're here. Hello. <laughs> what? I don't, I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to say. Do a better shot. Does anybody want Yeah, yeah, put the REM pod down. I filmed myself doing it. Yeah, I was, gonna, I was gonna do that as well. There's nothing coming through here. What's happening? My nose is dripping. It's absolutely... Any spirits that want to communicate here? I don't blame you if you don't want to. Yeah. <laughs> There's a beautiful lighthouse just out on the way, Cockrum Sands Lighthouse. Lovely bit of a history about that. Just out of the way from the Abbey is Plover Scar Lighthouse, also known as Abbey Lighthouse. Built in 1847, this is a pair of lighthouses, being the lower light, the lower leading light, whereas the higher light once stood next to the Abbey Lighthouse cottage on Slack Lane. These lights help ships navigate into the Loon Estuary to reach Glasson Dock and the Port of Lancaster. Originally, both lamps were paired with a paraffin lamp mounted onto par bollet reflectors. In the 50s, electric lamps replaced the oil lanterns. And by the end of the decade, the lights were fully automated with the high light on shore deactivated sometime in 1985. But this one still remains active. Hello. Hello. 
How many fingers have I got up? Can you go by that device over by the door we've put on the floor? Don't be alarmed by it. It just indicates that someone's here, that you're here. Can you touch that? Can you go near that? Can you touch that device? Can you touch that device? Absolutely nothing. My name's Gordon. This is Oliver. We've come to make contact with you. You can use this device. You can talk to us as an EVP session digitally. It will, no, you might not know that, but it will pick up any sounds. Uh, would you like to tell us your name? Would you like to say hello? Does anyone want to talk to us? Let's have a listen back. My name's Gordon, this is Oliver. We've come to make contact with you. You can use this device, you can talk to us as an EVP session digitally. Well, not that you might not know that, but it will pick up any sounds. Uh, would you like to tell us your name? And the wind is getting to it. Would you like to say hello? Does anyone want to talk to us? No. See, I've got this theory, and this has been here a thousand years, and I'm a great believer that paranormal energy dissipates over time. Now, if this has been here that long, any spirits roaming around, etc., it may have just disappeared. Energy moves on, it passes on, we know that. Um, so I wasn't that sort of hopeful we'd get something. I need to do a bit more research, maybe. Left a note at home. <laughs> and I think it might be a good idea to move now, because the weather is definitely turning in. Let's go. I'll try to get camera not stay on. I'm walking through weird terrain full of carpet and rocks and very, very wet mud. But it's still been a great adventure. Have you had fun? Yeah. Pretty cold, it's very wet. Don't forget to subscribe. Oh, and before we go down there, that little brick building down there looks like a pillbox in World War II. Could be wrong, if you know, comment section down below. Uh, onwards and upwards to our next adventure. And hopefully the weather will be better. Until next time. Dra. <laughs> I'll see you with one. You look like a right gangster, don't you? Oh, it's mud. Right, here we go.